Hey guys, this is Janelle Pika from Janelle Pika's Primal Strength Training, located right here at 903 East Carson Street in the south side of Pittsburgh, okay? I want to talk to you guys today about a brand new training program we came out with. It's called Become a Force to be Reckoned With. All the kettlebell lifts um, in this particular program involve double kettlebell complexes, presses, long cycle jerks, lots of kettlebell swings, basically every single lift you can imagine that's condensed into a four week program to make for you a very lean, mean kettlebell lifting machine, okay? Um, there are a handful of you now that are working with me on that particular program, and um, I've received um, repeated questions about one particular exercise routine that is involved um, in that manual, and it is a Turkish get up to a racked lunge. Today, what I have um, is my snatch chest weight kettlebell here, and I'm going to demo what that particular training routine looks like and show you a regression to the exercise as well as a progression to the exercise for those of you that are beginners, intermediate, or advanced. First up, okay, when using a weight for this, if you are brand spanking new, novice kettlebell lifter, okay, females, I recommend starting anywhere from a, let's say, 8 kilo to the upper portion of a 12 kilo. Guys, I recommend grabbing, you know, 14 or 16 kilo to the upper portion of a 20 kilo, okay? If you are intermediate, you may, as a female, you can grab a 12 to the upper portion of, let's say, a 16 kilo, depending on what your snatch test weight is for your certifications. Guys, same thing, 20 kilo to 24 kilo. Absolute maximum weights, if you were a lady, would be a 20 kilo on this. I do not recommend going any heavier than that because the amount of um, energy exertion you will exert on something heavier than that will um, start to add up. Guys, same rule applies. No heavier than a 28 kilo on this if you're super strong, okay? Now, what this looks like, okay? I'm using a 16 kilo for demonstration purposes today. First things first, I'm assuming you guys are familiar with what the circuit get up is, okay? If you do not, you may go back to a couple of previous posts that I've linked up in this blog um, today to reference what the Turkish get up actually is in comparison to some other lists with it, okay? All right, as we move on here, you're gonna start in your Turkish get up position and get yourself to a full on Turkish get up. Here to the top. Okay, once you're at your overhead lockout position, you're going to bring your kettlebell down into your rack position, okay? Kettlebell right now is on my right side of the body, okay? This is my right arm. You're gonna step out with the opposite leg, okay? Left leg lunge down, back, down, and back. You can't if you're really, um, if your mobility is on the right. You may get your knee to the floor, and come back, it is not necessary though. Once you do your rec scheme between five or six lunges, you're going to press your bell up, okay? Step back with the opposite leg, okay? Down to your Turkish get up, floor position, switch sides, okay? To show you guys what that looks like when you're doing fluently. I'll give you guys three, okay? That's what that's going to look like, okay? Press up, back on down. Okay. So, common questions I get are, how do I regress that if I'm brand new, because you're not comfortable with keeping the bell in the rack position? Or, for those of you that are super into challenging yourselves, how do we make that a lot more difficult, okay? Let's start with the easy one first, okay? Option number one, as a regression. Get yourself to the Turkish get up. Rock your bell, okay? What you're gonna do is use two hands, okay? Clean your bell down to the side. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys that one more time. Here's rack position. Use both hands to bring it down gently. Bell to the side, okay? What you'll then do is step up with the opposite leg and do loaded carry lunges, like so, okay? Once you complete your rep scene, clean your bell up, press it, on back down, okay? So that's the easy way, okay? For those of you that want more of a challenge, you may go.
better stop. All right. If you guys have any questions about um, your programming, for those of you that are on the forum, please follow me. Periscope cats are going to start um, Wednesday, August 3rd, 2016. Weekly, if not daily after that. Um, and for those of you that have missed out on this training program, stay tuned because we're coming out with another one here right in the middle of August that will make you stronger than you know. Thanks so much, everybody.